Today we're going to be talking about trekking poles and do they work. Hey guys, this was this is Champ, the Outdoor Chautauqua, and today we're going to be talking about trekking poles and do they really work. In a nutshell, yes. Okay guys, we got three trekking poles here. We're going to tell you we're going to tell you about all of them. First, we have mine. We bought them from Stephen Cheap. They are Mountain Smith Pinnacle. We paid about nineteen dollars for them. They're awesome poles. I love them. Next, we have the Cochineal system. They were uh, originally one pair, or not one pair, but uh, individual poles. So, you just bought two. The only downside to that is they have two compasses. But anyways, they are Trekker Anti-Shock. He paid about $15 for each of them. He picked them up at Cabela's.com in their bargain cave. And these are Cletus's. He picked his up on eBay. They would normally be about $150. He got them for $70. They're uh, lucky. They're super Macalu. Okay, guys. His, or Cletus's, have a nice uh, uh, cork, cork handle, and mine and Yukon Cornelius's have rubber handles, and all three of ours have anti shock. Cletus's are a little bit nicer, but he paid a little bit more, and mine and Yukon Cornelius's are made in China, and his are made in the Czech Republic. To adjust your pole, you would normally think you'd grab the black tip, or not black tip, but the black thing. You don't. Grab either you grab on either side of the black thing and twist righty tighty lefty loosey and then just pull it in and out to your desired height. Now all three of our uh, trekking poles come with a carbide tip. Mine came with a basket. Uh, Seven was a lot larger than this. It was a snow basket, so we took it off. And they normally come with a rubber tip on it, but if you're going to be hiking like in damp areas, the the dirt will just snatch it right off. To put it on, you need to hold it by the strap, put your hand through the strap, and just grip it normally. And then when you're hiking on a normal level surface, you just need your hands at a 90 degree angle. And if you're hiking up a hill for a long period of time, you're going to need to shorten your pole. But if you're hiking downhill, you need to extend your pole. And the strap is there because if you were to lose your grip or, or slip your hand out, this pole could still be used. And I was hiking, I have, I'm 90 pounds by 90 pounds, and I have a 30 pound pack. And if I stumble with that heavy load, I'm going down the mountain. And these poles actually worked as another pair of legs. I'm carrying a pretty heavy pack for a five day trip. So these poles help me take the weight off of, or some of the weight off of my legs and back and put them on my arms. In a nutshell, trekking poles work and I highly recommend them, and they, they're not a ton of money to buy. This is Champ, the Outdoor Chautauqua. Thanks for watching my video, and if you like my videos, subscribe. Bye-bye.